Hey guys, my name is Stephanie Davies and I want to talk to you today about what the day in the life of a coach looks like. So my business and my life looks a lot different now than it did three years ago when I became a coach. Um, but when I became a coach, I was nannying for multiple families and I had my one-year-old daughter in tow. My husband was working two jobs that literally had him gone all hours of the day and night and most days of the week. So it was up to me to manage my time and try to fit in little bits of building my business in the midst of this crazy schedule. So we work from this list called a power hour as a coach, which is really cool because if you have an hour that you can give your business each day, then you can start to begin to build something really, really awesome. Um, what I did when I was in that kind of crazy new building my business stage was I just found little pockets of time throughout the day. I think you'll start to notice when you're driving in the car and when I'm making coffee in the morning, all these little times when I wasn't doing anything, I started to fill with things that would move my business forward. Listening to training videos, um, doing my personal development, you know, getting my workout in when my daughter was having breakfast. Um, so it's all about finding the these pockets of time and also doing this list of activities that we'll give you when you join the team that really are the foundational activities that move your business forward. So having that list really helped me stay focused until I could begin to have more time to build my business. Um, my business, like I said, looks a lot different now. A day for our family looks a lot different. I've been able to retire my husband from both of his jobs, and now I'm a full-time coach, no longer nannying. And so our days are free to spend together. It took a lot of sacrifice um, when I was building my business, and my husband would be home in the evenings. You know, I'd have to ask him if he could put our daughter down. Um, I would just get a bunch of business done, and then we could have some time together in the evenings. But it was such a temporary period of sacrifices in the evening for us to now have all the time together in the world. He's building a business from home. We just had our second baby and we get to be home together all the time. So now my days are by my design. I um, just recently started getting up early so I could get my workout in before um, my daughters wake up. I have one daughter that's almost four and one that's three months sitting in my lap right now. Um, but I get up early to get my workout done and get my personal development in and by the time they get up that's out of the way and usually I've plugged into about a half an hour of work um, like I said I'm a full-time coach now with a big team to manage and a full plate with a newborn um, but I still probably put in four to five hours a day um, of work right maybe an hour on the weekends but that's because I love it and when I plug in to work, time flies. So before I know it, my time's up and I've got to get back with my family. Um, but I'm doing the same things that I did as a new coach. I'm posting to social media. I'm doing my workouts, my personal development so that I can grow. And that I think it's so cool that that's a part of my to-do list for my job each day. Um, I'm sending messages to friends to reconnect and grabbing coffee and reaching out to people to see if what has changed my life can change theirs. So the Power Hour specifically we'll talk to you guys more about when you join the team. Um, but I think what's important to remember is just that no matter how busy you are, you can find those little pockets of time. And if you can sacrifice, um, you know, one little hour out of your day, whether it's a hobby that's got to get put on hold so that you can do it full time once you become a coach. The, t the, the sacrifice is so temporary there in the beginning and so worth it. Um, now we can take up hobbies because we, we've built this business into something that gives us that freedom to design our schedules. So my days start early and then they end early. We're going to, you know, be able to take off and do whatever we want to do for the rest of the day, um, most days of the week once I get my work done. So we work from a, a specific list. Um, we've got coaches on our team that have built this with three kids at home and, you know, working full time, people in graduate school, um, you name it. If you really want this, um, you can make something really amazing happen with an hour a day at the beginning of your business and it will just change as your goals change and as your team grows. So I hope that helped you guys kind of get a glimpse into what the day of a life of a coach looks like. You know, we're 
working on us and growing and sharing that journey with others and it's pretty amazing so if you have any questions comment below I want to hear about you know what your story is like maybe if you have a concern about your time we can help you kind of work through that so post that below and um, I'll be around to answer your questions all right thanks guys